Thomas Pocklington Trust logo. Creating and delivering presentations using JAWS. Hashtag blind enable. Hi, my name is Darren Pascal. I am technology information champion here at Thomas Pocklington Trust. Assistive technology has come a long way over the past few years, enabling blind and partially sighted people to perform roles in the workplace as well as their fully sighted colleagues. Today I'm going to be showing how to use a screen reader, JAWS, to create and deliver presentations. Right then, well, let's open up this presentation. So I'm in PowerPoint, the presentation is open and we're on the first slide here. But how do we know that? Well, there are several panes here in, uh, in PowerPoint. There is the list of all the different slides. There's also the list of all the elements on each slide. And that's what we're interested in here. Where are we exactly? So actually when you're in the pane where you can move around the design of the slide, to move around is really simple. You just press the tab key. Center title placeholder, level one, accessible technology at work. There we are, Jules just read out that, uh, that object. The center placeholder is a title, and this particular title is the title of the slide, accessible technology at work. Great. Well, let's see what else is on this slide. Let's press tab one more time. Subtitle placeholder, level one, Thomas Pocklington Trust. So we've got a Thomas Pocklington Trust subtitle because, of course, this is just the title slide. But I'm, I don't really know how big this is or where it is in relation to the slide. So how can I tell that with a screen reader? Well, with JAWS running, you just press Control Shift D. Subtitle placeholder is 720 points wide and 64 points high in centimeters. This is 2.57 by 2.2. Now I just press control to interrupt JAWS there. It's actually displayed a whole load of information here regarding the layout of this element on the slide in the JAWS virtual viewer because there's so much information. It is probably easier if you can take it in bit by bit. So all we have to do here is just arrow up and down. Left edge is 78 points or 2.7 centimeters. Okay, so left edge is 2.7 centimeters and there's loads and loads of information here what I want to get to is the font size how big is this text and I from memory suspect that that might be a, about the last bit of information that JAWS presents here so we're in the virtual viewer let's can do control end to get to the bottom and go up Blank. subtitle placeholder full here based on current font size of 24 points 24 points and there it is great this is uh, all nicely displayed here, and we can do this with any slide element. So let's move on to the next slide. I'm going to press Escape to return to PowerPoint. Subtitle placeholder, level one, Thomas Pocklington Trust. Yeah. And now Shift F6 to get to the list of slides. And we're already on the... Accessible technology at work slide, one of 11. Accessible technology at work slide, let's go down. Thomas Pocklington Trust slide. Thomas Pocklington Trust. Itinerary slide. Itinerary, excellent. Now, I'm going to make some edits to this. I'm going to press F6 to get back to the slide design. No selection. And press Tab to change the title. Title placeholder, level one. So I've highlighted the title and I'm going to press Enter. Edit. And we've got this word itinerary. I'm going to change this to say presentation itinerary. So Edit. how do I do that? Well, we're at the top of this text. So I'm just going to type in presentation. Edit. And I'm going to change Six that I, I for itinerary India. to be T. small i. I. And it now reads India. presentation itinerary. Presentation itinerary. I just did the standard JAWS say line hotkey there. Insert up arrow to read out the whole text. All right, I'm going to press escape to stop editing. I'm happy with that. Let's just check what else is on here. What's the itinerary for this presentation? Object placeholder, level one, bullet panel discussion. Level two, bullet screen readers, braille displays and peripherals. Okay, panel discussion, uh, screen readers, peripherals. Excellent. Okay, I think we're just about ready to uh, to have a run through at giving this presentation. So how do we do that? Well, all we have to do is press F5. Restart timer button, presenter view slide. And here it is. So we're on the first slide and what we really want to do is start giving the presentation, but I don't want Jaws to be talking at me while I'm giving this presentation. That's why I have this Braille display in front of my laptop keyboard. So I'm gonna turn the speech off at this point. 
insert space S. Speech on demand. Speech on demand, excellent. And now we're ready to have a run through this presentation. So accessible technology at work, Thomas Bocklington Trust, welcome. I'm gonna to get to the next slide, so page down. And Thomas Bocklington Trust, who is Thomas Bocklington Trust? Who are we? Well, we support blind and partially sighted people to live the life they want to lead. We believe that blind and partially sighted people should have the opportunity to participate fully in society. And our strategy places particular focus around engagement, employment and education to support blind and partially sighted people to live the lives that they want to lead. And technology is a key enabler in all of these areas. So that is why we are here. In fact, without the technology, I don't think this would be happening, would it? And the next slide, so page down. And so the presentation itinerary. So what is gonna to happen today? Well, we've got essentially two halves of the presentation. The first half, the kind of discussion is gonna be around screen readers, browser displays and peripherals. We're also going to have uh, a look at strategies for accessible note-taking and also talk about um, productivity software. So whether that's Office 365 or G Suite. And we'll finish off with a Q&A. Looking good, all right. That's pretty much all there is to using PowerPoint with a screen reader. Thank you for watching. Please share this video with employers and other blind and partially sighted people. Find out more on accessible technology at vitaltech.org.uk and see how our employment service can help you progress your career at pocklington-trust.org.uk forward slash employment.